Right. <laughs> Greetings, infestors. I'll be with you in a moment. I was just putting these gross profits away for safekeeping. Got it! Ah, the kill of victory. <laughs> What's your problem, soldier? You some kind of mummy's boy? It looks like Neptune has just moved from Virgul to late Capricorn, which would mean you should avoid any serious romantic entstranglements for a while. We can help you get Morgue for your money, whether it's mutual fiends you want or cold, horrid cash. We can guarantee you'll coroner the market. <laughs> I'm fearest gup. Ha! Care for a chocolate? And I call. <laughs> Bleed em and weep. Spades beat hearts every time. <laughs> Talk about trial and terror. About face. Parade march. Hut, two, three, four. Hut, two, three, four. Present on! Now that's what I call active service. <laughs> Begin launch sequence. Gotta go, creeps! Wow! What a massacre! Hello, creeps. So glad you could join me for my weekly game. My deal. Hacks and chokers are wild. You sure? Mummy always said life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. And now it's time for business news. So, Chip, what happened on the shock exchanges today? Oh, sorry. Looks like it's time for the spurts report instead. <laughs> Sometimes you get a fudge scream. Uh-oh. Looks like I've got something. I just love eyes fishing. <laughs> Sometimes you get new guts. Greetings, travel fiends. It's so exciting being here in London. I'm already feeling right at tomb. Care to join me for a little fright seeing? Know what else Mummy said? She said, scary is as scary does. Hmm. Something about your horoscope isn't making sense. Let me see your hand. Yes. Yeah. Interesting. I'm not much at bleeding palms, but your future seems rather cloudy. Everybody loves finger food. <laughs> hey, you want a side of ghoul slaw with that? <laughs> I hope my story didn't scare you too much, Mr. Hitchcock. Actually, I'm a very big fan of yours. If you want, you can tell me a story. Hmm. I guess he knows the pecking order now. <laughs> I'm running for office because I think the political process needs a little stiff competition. It needs no leadership. It needs someone like me in the White House. 